The Battle of Jushi was a battle between the Han Dynasty and the Xiongyu for control of the people of the Jushi culture in the Turpan Basin in 67 BC. The battle was a success for the Han, who were led by Zheng Ji. The king of Jushi Wugi surrendered to the Han after the Han launched the attack from the Tarim Basin, and besieged the city Jiaoha, capital of Jushi. The Xiongyu came with aid to Jushi, but escaped after Zheng Ji and Sima Zai confronted the armies. Zheng Ji then left 20 men with a general to protect the king of Jushi, but he was afraid of the return of Xiongyu, and fled to Wusun. The Xiongyu installed Dumo as the king of Jushi, and moved the population further east from Jiaoha. Zheng Ji then sent 300 men to seize the city. Chapter 1 Aftermath In 60 BC, an internal disturbance occurred among the Xiongyu ruling clique, and Xiang Xianshan, Prince Raizu of the Xiongyu stationed in the Turpan Basin, led 12,000 of his troops and 12 royals to pledge allegiance to the Han Imperial Court. That same year, the Han appointed Zheng Ji as the Protector General of the Western Regions, with his office in Wuliai to oversee the entire region of the Tarim Basin west to the Pamir. The last Protector General, Dan Qin, was killed during a rebellion led by Yanqi in 13 AD. A brief attempt to restore the Protector Generalship was launched by Wang Mang in 16 AD, under the new appointed Protector General Li Chong. The armies soon advanced towards the state of Yankee, but were eventually defeated by Yankee with its allies. Li Chong fled to the state of Chotsa, and died soon after the fall of Xin Dynasty.